My son um, struggled when he was in preschool. And things that should have been easy for us as a family were not. It wasn't easy to go on play dates. It wasn't easy to go to a restaurant. We couldn't even go to the park without it being a struggle. One of the worries is that he won't make friends, he won't have the social skills that he needs to to stick up for himself against bullies and to just have someone to play with. My wife and I were pretty much on our own as far as raising my daughter when we had no source of information, uh, no support. We knew though, my husband and I, that while we were going through these kinds of struggles, that there had to be other families that were feeling what we were feeling. Um, there had to be people out there that were asking the same questions we were and wanted to know how to help their kids. And so we said if, if we could form Connecting for Kids and help just one family, just one family have an easier journey than what we faced, then we'd know the work was worthwhile. But we haven't helped just one family. We've helped more than a thousand families thousand families right here on the west side of Cleveland. It's run by a behavioralist and uh, she's fantastic. She goes around the room and she teaches us how to interact with our child, how to teach our child to interact with others. She's teaching him how to play with other children so that he's not going to be sitting in the corner and being lonely by just playing with his own toys all the time. She can teach me how to teach my son how to interact with others, then I, I feel like there's nothing we can't do. We can, we can overcome everything together. We feel welcome, you know, like we feel like there's no judging going on, like everybody's kind of going through the same thing. And you know, sometimes that's where you get the best advice from. You can talk to doctors, but they're not on the same ground as you. You know, when you go to events like this, you meet families and they tell you like, well, this kind of worked for us. So the connection with the other families, you know, it's, it's amazing. It's very educational. It's, uh, it's, it's amazing the support that you get knowing that there's other people there that have the same issues as you. Our daughter loves music. I mean, uh, I think it's a way to get her energy out. You know what I mean? Like, she doesn't sit at a desk and focus very long, but if you put like music sticks, you put a drum, you put a guitar in front of her and she just loves the strum, loves the tap, and she just, she, I mean, she naps better too, you know? I mean, yeah. you know, when she gets that energy out, like that, that's her way of releasing. The therapy for that for her is, that's what helps, you know, we know it's what helps our daughter, so we go to as many things as we can that involve that. And I also love that um, Connecting for Kids offers childcare for siblings if you need that. So that's just definitely a huge help. You know, to kind of have the whole family involved and not feel like he's excluded or she's excluded, it's, it's a real welcoming environment for everyone. How many more families haven't called us yet? How many more could we help? So that's our goal now for these next five years. To go out and, and see how many journeys, how many lives and families we can make better.